Slideshow videos are a great way to compile your still photo images and video footage into an awesome video. It's a pretty easy solution for video beginners and helps you keep good memories. Hi, I'm Anna from Wondershare Demo Creator, and today I'm going to show you how easy it is to make a video slideshow using photos and video with music in Wondershare Demo Creator. Please keep watching. If this is your first time here, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss the latest tips and tricks for video creation. You can create a video slideshow for pretty much any occasion. For a wedding, for graduation, a birthday, for a festival, for your pets, for your friends, or even if you want to make a slideshow because you took a trip recently and you want to save some memories for family and friends. Slideshow videos are unique and it's a great starting point if you're interested in video editing. Thinking back, the first video that I ever created was for a slideshow that was for a fun vacation. And I'm sure many of you would love to be able to create one too. So now I'll show you how to do it. Wondershare Demo Creator has a ton of cool features and effects available to you to take your videos to the next level. So if you have some photos and footage lying around on your computer or your hard drive, I'm going to show you how easy it is to take those images and footage and turn it into an awesome video slideshow. So let's begin. First of all, you'll need Wondershare Demo Creator. If you haven't updated or downloaded it and you're new to Wondershare Demo Creator, you can download it for free by clicking on the link in the description. After downloading it, launch the Wondershare Demo Creator program and click the Video Editor button to start your slideshow video making. Next, you need to bring in any photos or videos that you want to add to your slideshow in Demo Creator. You can do that by clicking on the import icon to import your media files and then drag your favorite images and clips onto the timeline. Now you have a base for your video slideshow and you can technically export the video directly, but that might be a little boring. So let's use some features in Demo Creator to level up your video slideshow. First, let's start by adding a title to start the slideshow and fade it right into the footage. In the Captions tab, there's a variety of titles and openers you can use and customize for your videos. For this slideshow, I'm going to keep it simple, so I'll choose a primary text title against a black background. What I need to do is drag and drop it onto the timeline. Afterwards, select all your photo footage and drag them to the right so you have a position for this title opener. After that, you can double click the text title to change and adjust the text. For example, you can change the font, text size, text color, border, and so on. But I like the current font, so I've just changed the title name. If you want to add more text to your slideshow video at any point in time, just select the kind of text you want and drag and drop it onto the timeline and edit it as you like. Super easy. If you'd like a photo to show for a shorter period of time, just drag the border to make it smaller. Now, you might notice some videos and photos don't match the size of the project. This will result in black bars around the clips that might not be the look you're going for. So, to remove the black bars, you can do two things. You can double click on the clip, and on the right editing window under Transform, you can adjust the size of the clip by sliding the slider under Scale. This will zoom in on the image and remove any black bars around the clip. For clips that are vertical, you can also scale the image so that it fills up the slideshow window. You can do that by dragging the video clip border to adjust it. You can also check the rest of the images one by one in this way. When mixing video footage and photos, sometimes going from a video clip to a photo looks jarring. To take a closer look, I'll zoom in on our timeline like this. So I'm going to add transitions to the slideshow to smooth things out and add some excitement for the viewers. Wondershare Demo Creator has a built-in transition, so all you have to do is find one you like and drag it between the clips. You can also adjust the transitions by dragging the transition effect and adjusting the duration or click to delete and replace the transition. The video slideshow is looking good, but let's add a few extras to tie everything together. If you'd like, you can add some sticker effects. In the Stickers tab, there are lots of effects available for you. You can select what you want and drag it onto the timeline. 
You can change the position or adjust the size by dragging the border or using the edit tool on the right editing window. At this point, the entire slideshow almost looks complete. But if you want to make your video more appealing, why not add some background music? You can download music on a royalty-free site or import your own music files into Demo Creator. Just make sure that you have the rights or permission to use the music. After I've added the song to the timeline, I'd like the length of the music to match the length of my slideshow, so I'll need to cut it at the end. You can do that by selecting the music track and right-clicking and choose Split. You can also do this by clicking on the Split icon here and delete the unnecessary section. After that, you can adjust the music volume, set an auto fade in and fade out in Demo Creator. To do that, you just need to right click the audio track and select the Edit Audio. Then a hand icon will appear and you can adjust the volume by dragging the hand. What's more, there's a small round dot at the start and end of the track. You can click and drag it to set the fade in and fade out. Okay, you can see I've got a fantastic video slideshow now. A slideshow video can be made for all kinds of special occasions or events. It's all a matter of how you edit it, and Wondershare Demo Creator makes that fun and easy to do. What are your memorable days and what photos will you edit by using Wondershare Demo Creator? Let us know in the comments and maybe next time we'll have a tutorial on how to do it. Finally, if you want to see more videos, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. See you next time.